Hi guys, welcome to your vocal exercises. Today we're going to be doing some vocal exercises that will be helping you with transitioning between textures within your voice. That has to do with the amount of pressure you're putting on your vocal folds and going from a breathy, disconnected voice to a tighter, more powerful voice at a rapid acceleration. So if you're ready, let's dive on in. Keep in mind that these are introductory exercises for texture changes. We will be doing more intense ones in my next texture change video. And if this is posted at a future date, then please check out my channel for texture changes part two. But with all that said, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing if you'd like to see more vocal exercises like this. And don't forget to hit that like button and ring that bell before we dive on in. With all that said, let's dive on in to your vocal exercises. For exercise number one, we're going to be starting out with a breathy, disconnected vocal tone. So I want you to start by accessing this tone by going very soft and light. Go You're going to feel like you're singing on a sigh. I also want you to activate the yawning part of your voice. So you're going to feel like you're lifting the soft palate and yawning into these notes. We're going to begin on an awe vowel, starting here. It should feel breathy, light, and back of the throat. We go. One more time for an additional demonstration. Continue on up on your own. Excellent work. For exercise number two, we're going to be activating the opposite texture, which is going to be a tighter vocal fold connection. You're not going to have any breathiness on this one, and you're going to be in a forward placement with more power in your voice. Starting with the exact same notes that we were doing before, and we're going to be doing an ah vowel, but we're going to add an N before to help move it into the front of the mask. Starting here, feel your vocal folds come together at a nice rate. Make sure that they're not too tight and not breathy. No. One more time. No. Now you're going to add it into the full exercise. No, no, no. One more time. No, no, no. Continue on up. Next exercise, we will start to include our transitions between our textures. So we're going to be utilizing the same notes. I'm going to change the vowel sound just so you have some diversity in vowels. And we're going to start out with an O vowel, keeping the N before to help 
keep it in forward placement. We're gonna start in that tighter vocal fold connection with a strong no. No. Go ahead and try that with me. No. Now on the high note, you're going to go breathy, light, falsetto, and back of the throat. We go. So we're gonna transition between the two. If you happen to have a little bit of a vocal break in between, that's okay for right now. Right now we're just worried about changing between the textures. We are not worried about making sure that the texture changes are smooth. It's okay if there's an abrupt break between the two. What you're getting used to is feeling the two different textures in your voice. So starting here. No, no, no. One more time. No, no, no. Continue on up on your own. Final exercise, we're going to be starting in your chest voice and we're going to be starting in the back of the throat, breathy, disconnected voice. We're going to be doing this on an E vowel and we're going to then change on the high note into your forward placement um, with a tighter vocal fold connection. So we're going to go. This one goes up pretty high, pretty fast. So make sure that you start in your chest voice and that you can feel that you're in your chest voice when you start with this, because like I said, it will go up very high, very quickly. Then switch voices. Put it together. One last demonstration. Continue on up on your own. work guys i hope you enjoyed these vocal exercises and if you did please don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more vocal exercises like this also don't forget to comment below as i love to hear from you guys and please keep in mind as you continue on with your practice especially while working on texture changes to be patient with yourself it takes time to acquire vocal control such as this so please don't forget to comment below any thoughts or questions you may have and i look forward to seeing you in the next one. Bye guys!